Sea Manta is a floating dive and recreation structure, half above water and half below. It's a combination between a floating reef and a kind of an entertainment area where people can enjoy all the advantages a floating reef has. Below water is a floating coral reef that can be used for breeding species but also used as a dive attraction. We were asked to create a dive experience and we thought we want to take also advantage out of that and turn it around and to create something which is paid by dive tourists but which is creating benefits in terms of environmental impact. It's a little bit challenging because nobody has built it before so therefore we had to invent another kind of structure. We've been doing some really intricate 3D modelling on the structure but also printing that out and testing that in the physical sense in the wave tank and wind tunnel at Griffith. We are transferring some parameters coming from architecture onto the sea but at the same time, we are also working very, very closely together with engineers. So this structure has been developed on basis of engineering solutions. The way that we as architects can incorporate those skills into new avenues and design strategies has been really interesting. The way that we can merge our skills with more industrial and engineering-based skills has been really cool to experiment with. We were very, very cautious that it was not only about the experts, so we were taking all the time also students on board who were working as research assistants with us, and without them, I don't know if it would have happened so successfully. I think the project's definitely given me a lot more perspective on the situation facing our reefs and our oceans. Our coral reefs face quite an uncertain future, and so the intention was to help educate people about the future, but in a fun and economically viable way.